Hi, I'm Betty, and I'm DDC's Director of Support and Onboarding. In this video, I'll explain what pass keys are, as well as why and how to use them. DDC recommends that everyone in and around a political campaign, including friends, family, and volunteers, enable a pass key, because if bad actors can compromise someone associated with a the campaign, they can likely compromise the campaign. Passkeys are the most simple and secure form of multi-factor authentication you can use. They replace passwords as a way of signing in and accessing accounts. Passkeys are a little bit of encrypted code that resides on a device like a phone, a computer, or a security key. When you log on to a device like your phone, you might use your fingerprint or your face as your first factor of authentication. Then when you go to access an account, you can use your unique passkey as the second factor. Since the passkey is linked to your device and is encrypted, it can't be used by anyone else to access your accounts. So now that we've talked about why you should use your passkey, I'm going to show you how to set it up. So I am going to demonstrate using my Google account but it's pretty much the same um, process to set up a pass key on any type of online account. So I will log into my account. I'll go over to the settings, click on account. I'll go over to the left and click on security. I will scroll down a little bit to where it says pass keys and security keys. I'll click on that. Click create a pass key. Click continue. And then here I'm going to do as instructed. So I will verify my identity with the touch ID on my computer. And that's it. So I've now created a pass key uh, to log into my Google account with my computer. So the pass key is on my computer. I'll click done. And then I'll show you how to add another because there's a few ways uh, you can add pass keys. So I will click create a pass key again. Use another device. And as you can see, I could create a pass key on my phone or tablet by scanning the QR code or down at the bottom, as you can see, I can use a USB security key. So that's what I'm gonna do this time. I'm gonna use my security key that looks like this. So I'll insert the security key as instructed. I'll create a pin. I'll click next. I'll touch the light up spot as instructed. I'll click allow. Um, and that is it. So now I've created two pass keys to log into my Google account. One is on my computer and one is on my physical security key. Um, so hopefully this helps show you uh, how beneficial and easy it is to set up a pass key. So thanks for watching. Bye.